I just wanted to keep you waiting. Right. You again. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love seeing you. But you're back here again. You're not looking after yourself very well, are you? Keep injuring yourself. I thought I was clumsy, but I think you give me a good run for my money. Okay, well, never mind, it's not too bad. Yeah, I read the notes so I can see some of the damage, as it were. Okay, don't worry, I haven't read your looks or anything, it's still a mess. Okay. Just promise me you'll be a little bit more careful in the future. So, yeah, okay. Well, you are quite a silly sausage, aren't you? Okay, so it's, yeah, it's pretty much uh, all superficial wounds. That's not going to make them hurt any less, I understand that, but just be thankful there's nothing major, okay? So, uh, as you know by now, my name's Dr. Sean. Yeah, you've seen me once or twice before. Yeah, it's been uh, eventful, hasn't it? Uh, it's been interesting. We like repeat customers. <laughs> but we don't like, you know, people to injure themselves too often. It does make it a little bit, you know, life a little bit more interesting when we see the same people come back again and again and again. So what we're going to do then, is just going to be cleaning the face and the wounds and just making sure that nothing gets uh, infected. Okay, I don't want to try any of that over, it's going to be fine, I promise you that. Okay, you're in very good hands here. I care about you immensely and I'm going to make sure you leave here feeling a little bit less pain and a little bit more positive. And quite possibly, and probably, a little bit more sleepy. Yes. Apparently it's what we Put my patience to sleep. It's a skill. Right. So, I think just to be on the safe side, I may run a few basic tests. Is that okay? Just to make sure your ears and eyes are working as they should. It's okay. Okay, fantastic. So, let me start with um, a quick eye chart, okay? So, I'm going to point to a letter, you tell what that letter is. So, if you can keep your uh, left eye closed for me, so you can cover it over or wink, whichever you want to do. Okay, so let me know what the letter is. I'll point to here. We go with the left eye closed. Okay, you can close over the right for me, and again, tell me what the letter is. Okay, that's good. I'm going to have a quick look in your eye and lung, okay? Quickly test your hearing, though, is that okay? Okay, so you're an expert by now, so you know what I'm going to do. Okay, so I'm going to place this on the forehead. Okay, we'll do two tests, the uh, Renee and uh, Weber tests, okay? So I'm just going to place this on your forehead. It's going to be a little bit cold. So let me just warm up that uh, end of the tube, Falk. Don't want you being cold now. Okay, it should be okay. Yeah. Alright, so I'm going to the forehead. I'm going to give it a hit. I'm going to ask you if it sounds the same, more or less, on both sides, okay? even for your left and your right ears. Okay. And just one more time. Okay. Okay. There you go. Again. Sound more or less even on both sides. Okay. 
So we're going to do uh, different tests now. So I'm going to be placing this behind the ear, giving it a hit. Okay, that's position one, and I'm going to be changing the position to that position. Okay, so I'm going to start behind the ear, move to this position, and then I'm going to be asking you which position is louder, position one behind the ear, or position two alongside the ear. Okay. Okay, you got this. You can do this. Yeah. Okay, so here's position one. Position two. Okay, which was louder, position one or two? Okay. Other side, same again. So starting on position one. Position two. Okay, which was louder, position one or two? Okay, so um, I'm fairly happy with the ears and eyes. Okay, I want to quick check with the um, ophthalmoscopes to make sure everything is good. Okay, so let me dim in the light for this check. I think I'm going to be checking um, the red eye reflex as well as the um, accommodation reflex. Okay. So all it means is I need to shine your uh, your eye, sorry, the light into both eyes on two occasions. Okay, in each eye. Okay. So we'll do the first check, and I'll change my setting. We'll do the second uh, check. All right. How are you feeling? Okay, feeling a bit more positive. Glowing, that's uh, yes, quite a sight to see. All right, I'm gonna dim the lights there so we can get nice and romantic. Okay, so let me put this on. Okay, there we are. So uh, I'm gonna be shining a bright light into your magnificent left eye in three, two, one now. And we're finished, thank you very much. And the same check this time on your right eye in three, two, one, now. And we're done, well done, good. Okay, so, next check. So again, I'll be showing a bright light to your left eye in three, two, one, now. Done, well done. And we're going to be shining this very naughty bright light into your right eye. In three, two, one, now. There we go. Well done. Okay, no more shining. Uh, actually, I'll tell a lie. I'm going to do a quick check while we're here, might as well. I want to be thorough, I want to make sure that you are in as good a health as possible. Okay, so just look forward for me. Good. Okay, keep looking forward. To look at my nose for me, just keep looking at my nose and try to ignore the light. Okay, keep looking at my nose, please. Okay, if you could look up for me, okay, and if you look down. So you just all uh, test there just to make sure everything is good and I'm very happy now so we can proceed with the cleaning of the wounds, okay. I'm gonna pop the light back on though so I know what I'm doing. Okay. Okay, so um, I think to begin I'm just gonna Just to make sure everything's good and clean. Okay, just have a little look. Okay, I think uh, 
Um, yeah, just to be sure, I'm just really feeling around the uh, scalp area. Is that okay? It can be difficult to see wounds in the scalp, so um, I'm going to be pressing, applying a bit of pressure, and I want you to tell me if there's any pain or discomfort felt. Okay. All right. I'm going to not. I'm going to. I have to be firm, but I'm not going to, you know, be rough or anything. So it's you're going to feel a slight pressure, but I'm not going to be hurting you. Hopefully, I'm going to be gentle as I can, basically. Any pain at all? Feels okay? Yeah, okay. Cool, okay. Feels okay. Good. And that feels okay. Okay. Now, just quickly put your ears. And I'll be a very thorough here. use the otoscope to go deep into the ears. There's no trauma in the ear area. Okay, I'll take your word for it. So I might need to check the otoscope. Um, but we're just checking any surface damage, any um, exterior portions of you know, any injury to the surface. But um, no, it looks fine, okay. So that's the good news, your ears and eyes. Fine? Yep. So, um, it may sting a little, but it's very unlikely. I would say there's about a 1% chance that this is going to sting, okay? So it's a very gentle, mild solution. Okay. Anti-bacterial and antiseptic mix. That should be pleasant, actually. It should take the pain away from it. That's what they have for. Okay. Okay, how's that? Does that feel okay? You're getting some relief. special to me. Yes, no expense spared. Okay, okay. so just around the chin area. Is it okay if I put my hand on your shoulder?
Yes. So let me look at you now. Chill very slightly. Okay. Mm hmm. Well, all your features are in the right place. Well, most of them. Um, and yeah, you look good. I think there's one or two little rooms I'm just going to give a little bit extra attention to. Scissors here, and I'll try not to stand myself over them. Okay, yes, I feel like the sounds. Again, there. Uh, we'd like to treat our uh, patients with special care and attention. So you can get some nice, relaxing sounds thrown in for free. Sterile gold pad, okay. So I'm just gonna um, use this to uh, got this other solution here, okay. So I'm just gonna be treating, applying the solution to the uh, bigger wounds just to make sure that they are, you know, accelerate the healing of them, okay. Dropping us everywhere. Seems to be okay. So, let me see the one above the right eye. Uh, one next to the left ear. And I think that's probably it, is it? And there's one near the right ear that's mm, sort of just about, yeah, just about next to the cut off, I think. So, three wounds, okay, so nice and still. Shouldn't hurt, okay. Do take better care of yourself in the future. Yes. We love seeing you, but um, you know, it's going to be too regular now, isn't it? Um, be more careful. Be good to yourself. Slow down. Any pain again? If there's any sort of irregularities, I'll pass you on to you know, specialists with the ears and the eyes, okay? But I don't see any need to do that because they're working as they normally are, okay? Or at least you're normal, all right? So, no um, detrimental effects to the hearing or vision, so I'm very happy with that, okay? So, the, most of these wounds will heal within about 48 to 72 hours. The bigger wounds may take a little bit longer to close. Any concerns or problems do pop back in our game. Because we'd love to see you. Alright. Good. Okay. 
Well, I hope you found this relaxing. And I hope you take a better care of yourself in the future. So my job here is done, at least for the time being. Do take good care of yourself, okay? And um, hopefully won't see you back here as often. Okay, but don't leave it too long because we might miss you.